Greetings, YouTube. I am having a good day so far. Knock on wood that the U.S. Um, Non-American football. Every time I say the word soccer, my across the pond fans like throw something at their mobile device. Uh, it's like a it's like a bad word, you know. But that's what we call it over here. Even though our American football is mostly played with your hands, and I. Um, I don't know, maybe, maybe it should have been called, like, tackle ball or something, because you have to tackle the defender, as in, like, grab them around and throw them down. Um, random tangent to start out this video. But, it's been a while. We're talking about since Friday, and it is now Tuesday, that we have had an important in-game inbox update to talk about on the YouTube channel. But that ends right now, because unsurprisingly or maybe surprisingly they have made some updates look at this iso now the gold is only about 12 bucks worth of gold but for some of you who just spent a million points in the level up event you need all the gold and iso you can get so this was a really nice surprise gift the six energy refills are significant and let me tell you why because as we claim this, we only have, uh, believe it or not, a small amount of time left comparatively to the end of the uh, November event quest. At the time of recording this, we have just about a week, a week from tomorrow. And so, let's say hypothetically you are like myself. You have a max amount of energy refills that uh, you can hold. <laughs> and I can't believe I have 13 in my overflow. That might also be a record. Well, Kabam should, in theory, listen to me, but they never do, and make all items, especially like arena boost. Why is it that arena boost expire after like three days of getting them? I hate that so much. It's one of my biggest pet peeves in the in inventory overflow issues. Keep in mind when I first played this game, you know, a thousand years ago, there were no inventory overflow issues because there was no inventory overflow. And Kabam finally caught on that people were saving hundreds of revives and thousands of potions for when they needed them. And they realized that if they didn't change the system, people would never need to spend their credit card on units to help get revives and potions. So then they put these inventory overflow rules in and they're not consistent and they're very confusing. And then when they finally decided to expand the inventory a little bit, they made it a pay-to-play system where the Black ISO store was heavily involved in inventory. And honestly, the number one reason why I subscribe to the Black ISO store is the inventory cap increase because it's so relevant to so many of the items that I hoard and use, especially rank-up materials. Uh, some of you are probably like me, where even after all the rank-ups you did on the Level Up event, you are still staring down the barrel of your inventory. 33 Tier 5 Basic is fine, but look at my Tier 2 Alpha. 95. I really don't know if I'm going to be able to spin them all. I might have to start raking up some 5 stars just to use them because we can't sell them even for 100 tier 3 alpha fragments per. But enough of that. Back to the point at hand. When you go to your inventory overflow, you'll see that one of the weird uh, coding rules is that you have 14 days from the time that you collect the energy refills to have them not expire and we have about half that time left in uh the event quest so i am um really thrilled what a nice surprise and as always i like to keep videos under five minutes so we're gonna go ahead and end this here because you know all we need to do is talk about it and then we're good you know no need to stall just for more revenue let's end the video here and everybody have a great rest of your day